earthly wisdom cannot save you. But the Word of God says in John the third, the third chapter, the very first verse, there was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews. The same came to Jesus by night and said unto him, Rabbi, we know that thou art a teacher come from God, for no man can do these miracles that thou doest except God be with him. Now the important point to recognize here is that Nicodemus said that he and others believed that Jesus Christ came from God because of the miracles that he was doing. It was no way possible that Jesus could do these things outside of some entity other than himself. The confusion was which God was he getting his power from. And I believe that was in the mind of Nicodemus. He wasn't really sure as he was probably elected by some of the Jews themselves to go and question Jesus. But I want you to know that you cannot be saved by earthly wisdom. Though they had a knowledge of what Jesus was doing and where it was coming from, they still did not have the ability to fully understand. Now the reason that they were incapable of understanding exactly what was taking place was because of the earthly wisdom that they had been given by their teachers from uh, their Jewish sects, sects, the different uh, the Pharisees and the Sadducees and the scribes. They had ways of believing, and they said they believed what their forefathers taught them, and they were proponents of that religion. But dearly beloved, religion has kept many from Jesus today. Religion may be exactly what is keeping you from Jesus today, from knowing who he is and to establish yourself in a relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ. Religion can be a very dangerous thing. One has been indoctrinated in a way of believing by their parents or their four parents or whoever their guardian may be and they never experience the new birth which Jesus will share with Nicodemus but it's very important for us to know that earthly wisdom cannot bring salvation to a soul one of the things that kept Nicodemus from the position of knowing the Heavenly Father in the way that Jesus desired for him to know him through the new birth was because of fear of condemnation from others. The question we have to ask ourselves when we walk in this life, is there fear of condemnation of others? And I believe many times there are those who do not establish a relationship with the Father or come to a place where a new birth can take place. Dearly beloved, we need to know the Lord as our Savior, but we need to be as according to the Scriptures, and Jesus will say later, born again. Nicodemus was not born again because he did not know exactly what that meant, but Jesus will surely give him the information that he needs as he gives us the information that we need. Dearly beloved, earthly wisdom cannot save. God bless you today.